for those of you who know Alan and have known him for a long time, I've known Alan since we were teenagers, which is a hell of a long time ago. Alan's always led with his heart. He's an extremely passionate guy. When he gets into something, he gets into it. It's the reason why he was a, a, a kid growing up in, in Roscommon and Ballyegan. And he managed to come to Dublin. And 10 years after he came to Dublin, he managed to get Ireland caps uh, to play for Ireland in his late 20s, which was unheard of. I think back to that time and I, I was thinking, geez, I, I don't think I could ever be more proud of Alan. Uh, but I was wrong. I think back to a day when I met Alan, I hadn't spoken to him in a while, he, he wasn't having the best of times, but I met him in a coffee shop and he started telling me, he, he, he just started seeing this girl and, and she's saying how lovely she is and, and she's, she's really, you know, she's, she's lovely, he, he was into her and, I, and knowing how Alan is, how he just, he's passionate, he goes with his heart, I just said, okay, well take, take things easy, Alan, you know, just take, take things easy. and. Um, then, you know, I, I get to meet Lynn, I get to meet her wonderful family and, uh, you know, I, I find myself saying to Alan, Alan, she's the best thing that's ever happened to you, there's no doubt about it. for us 11 years into their love story. And now is a time to pause, look back and smile and all the moments that brought them here. And a time to look ahead at all the moments that are still to come. Look at one another and remember this moment. Before this moment, you have been many things to one another, but now keep this moment in your memory. Alan is very competitive, whether he plays sport or games. He won't even let Ethan win a PlayStation. <laughs> I hope that he puts the same effort and the same pride into the marriage because you have everything. You don't need nothing. You just have each other, you have your four kids, and life is out there.
by chance, but you are here today because you are making a choice. You both are choosing each other. You have chosen to be with someone who builds you up, who makes you think, makes you smile, and makes every your day brighter and better. First of all, I'd just like to say, like to say um, I'm the luckiest man in the world to have Lynn as, as a partner and now a wife. Um, she looked absolutely fantastic today, but in all honesty, she does nearly every day with her smile. Um, it's, um, it's one of the things that I love about her so much. As your favorite person to love with her, go on adventures with her, support her, be proud of her, grow old with her and find new reasons to love her. I will. Will you Lin? Keep on as your favorite person to love with him, go on adventures with him, support him, to be proud of him, grow old with him and find new reasons to love him. I mean. Now I pronounce you like a husband and a wife and you, Alan, can kiss your beautiful wife. <laughs> Alan, I've always been immensely proud of you, incredibly proud of you. Uh, today you must be the proudest man alive, and rightly so. Uh, and I just want to propose a toast to the bride and groom. Thank you so much. Bride and groom. Bride and groom.